Bass 2021 Season Update is out now, and as far as console gaming goes, the game's notorious lack of licenses can once again be rectified rather easily on PlayStation 4. Xbox One players are sadly still not allowed to make any modding changes to the game from an external source, such as a USB flash drive, so the option file method that we're about to show you works only on the PS4, and it is relatively simple to execute. Here's what you gotta do. So the first thing you want to do is download the custom option file made by the amazingly talented Passvizio BR. After downloading the file, extract it and look for a folder titled WEPES. Make sure that you do not edit the folder or its files in any way. Just transfer it to your USB flash drive as it is. Another important thing to make sure of is that the USB flash drive is in the FAT32 format, otherwise the PlayStation 4 will not be able to read it. And that concludes all you need to do on your PC. Now let's take you through what you have to do on your PS4. First, locate and delete the game's edit data on your PS4 by following the path that you can see on the screen. If you've never made any changes to the game, you can skip this step. Then start up eFootball Past 2021 Season Update and go to the Settings page and then press Edit. Here you'll be presented with a screen asking you to create edit data. Hit Yes and then just wait until the data is created. When that is done, go to Import Export and hit Import Team. Then select all files by pressing the square button and then hit Next. Now this will take you to a screen with some detailed settings. Make sure to tick the second box only and then press OK. And this will launch the process of editing your teams to have their correct names, kits and emblems. Note that because there's a fair number of teams to edit, the process might take quite a while. So just be patient as you wait for it all to be done. After updating the teams, the next thing to edit are the competition emblems. Now luckily, this process is just as simple and nearly identical in steps. Just go to the import export screen again, hit import competition, select all files like before, tick the detailed settings box and watch the magic happen. Once you're done with importing the emblems, you will have all the major existing teams and competitions updated with their correct info and past 2021 season update. The only thing left to do now is save the changes you've made and you're officially done licensing your game. This custom option file works with every single mode in the game, both online and offline, so we strongly recommend that you take the time to install it. In fact, have a look at what this custom option file brings to your game. So that's how you install the custom option file to eFootball Past 2021 Season Update. If you have any questions about this guide, let us know in the comment section below and we'll be happy to help. And please make sure to head over to alker.com for much more content like this. And please subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any of our upcoming content. Thanks a lot for watching, this is Sobreal and see you in the next video.